Hey guys and welcome back to another video. In today's video, we'll be going through how to use the OpenAI API with Node.js. Now this API allows us to access all the different OpenAI models. You can see them listed over here. We've got different versions of GPTs. We've got DALI, which can be used to create images. TTS, which is text-to-speech. Whisper, that can convert audio into text. So yeah, there's a lot we can use this for. But in today's video, we'll be focusing on using GPT. Now, if you want to be able to use this API, you need to create a key. Here's the page where we can generate new keys. As you can see, I already have one, which I named my key, but I'll show you how to create a new one. It's very easy. So we just click on create new secret key. And then, yeah, call it whatever you want. I'm just going to call it key and then create secret key and then yeah so it generates the key and gives you the opportunity to copy it down because once you close this you'll never be able to see it again well on this page at least but wherever you decide to save your api key make sure it's safe because if someone else gets a hold of your key they can use it to do whatever they want and potentially rack you up a charge which you wouldn't want obviously so for me personally i'm going to be deleting that key after this video now even though this is a paid api one nice thing is that they give us some free credit so if you go over to usage you can see that they give five dollars when you start now let's get into actually using this api so if you haven't got it installed already you just need to run in your project npm install open ai okay so let's import it in Okay, just like that. Now let's create our API client. So I'm going to call it client. And this is what I have to write in. New open AI dot open AI. And then I'm simply going to put in the API key and then paste that in. So yeah, you may or may not want to paste your API key right here. It just depends on whether people will be able to see it or not. So if you're going to make a public GitHub repository for a project you're making, then it wouldn't be a good idea to put it here because even if you remove it, people will be able to see it through the earlier commits. Also, if you're going to be distributing uh, a project, then I wouldn't do it like this either. Another option is to save it as an environment variable. So now that we've got that set up, let's create our prompt. So I'm going to make an async function. going to call it run prompt. Okay, so let's create a variable called completions. And this is going to be our API call. So we're going to need an await statement in there. And then we're going to write client.chat.completions.create. And we need to pass an object inside this. But before that, actually, I want to put this in a try block so that we can catch any errors. And let's just write catch error console.log error. Now inside this object, we need a key called messages. Messages and that will be equal to an array with an object inside. So the two things that we need to define inside here is the role and the actual prompt. So the role, I'm going to set as system. And the content, we're just going to say, tell me a joke. So content is where the actual prompt goes. And then the next thing we need, or the last thing even, is the model. So in our case, I'm just going to use GPT 3.5 Turbo. Now that's it. So let's give it a run. Node index.js. Oh yeah, and of course we need to actually output this. <laughs> so console.log completions. But now we need choices and the first one. So Choices is all the different outputs that we get from the prompt we created. So yeah, 
we're just going to get the first one and let's run that okay so you can see we have a joke here why couldn't the bicycle find its way home it had lost its bearings very funny let's run it again why did this scarecrow win an award because he was outstanding in his field okay you get the point but yeah this is a very basic example of how we can use chat gpt inside of node.js if you have any questions please leave them in the comments below if you like the video please drop a like and subscribe for more content thanks for watching the video